Bathrooms we're at. Bath and Money Works. Looks like somebody. Oh, we got something in there. A broken one wick candle. Broken eucalyptus. Pretty empty perfume. Bunch of gift card holiday envelopes. I always take these because you can store them. Hey guys, I just got back from dumpster diving. I'm done for the night, so I'm gonna go over some of my finds. So yeah, this is a whole box from Bath and Body Works. It has some weight to it, so I'm hoping it's got some good stuff. I see some goodies up top. And um, don't mind my one nail. I'm practicing acrylic right now, trying to do my own acrylic. So yeah, not going too well. But anyways, it looks like we have one three wick candle right here. And the scent is Black Cherry Merlot. One wallflower, but it's leaking. Ooh, what's this? We have some more wallflowers down here. This one's pretty full. That one is leaking, but you could combine them if you wanted to. We have another broken candle. This is a one wick. And this one is so very thankful. That's a new one, I think. Cool. Some kind of spray. We have aromatherapy sleep spray. We have another, hold on another broken one wick candle this one is in harvest pomegranate that's new too i think and then i think there might be something in here looks like we have an empty jar return i always save these because once you clean the glass off you can just pop a candle right into these we have another wallflower oh i don't think i showed you guys the scents this one is leaves and i have no idea what that one is probably some kind of christmas scent these look like a bag of returns. We have sugared lemon zest. It's about a little bit less than halfway full. Yeah, definitely return. Um, Sun-drenched linen. We have a eucalyptus mint and it's a little bit less than halfway full. I still use them up. Good for like little bathroom candles. And then we have a raspberry mimosa halfway full. Somebody went on a return spree. This one is white lavender eucalyptus, halfway. Halfway, this is black cherry merlot. Honey crisp apple. And then the last one, pumpkin apple, a little bit less than halfway full. I'll still burn them. We have another wallflower hidden over here. And then we have some stapled bags. So let's open it up. Open sky, halfway burnt. Candles, I think these are returns. This is empty. Oh, scribbled it pretty good. And then, I love the packaging on this one. Definitely gonna reuse this jar, Autumn Woods. It's pretty empty. And then the last bag, they're all empty. So somebody returning very burnt candles. Why are you scribbling on things? Um, some kind of little bag, probably a gift set bag. Really cute. A empty candle can reuse those jars and that is it all right not a bad little score you guys hey guys this is a burlington this isn't my normal burlington this is a different one and they destroy so i don't know this kind of looks like it might be okay i'm gonna take that see how they destroyed this box so uncalled for toys Use a poppet headband. Oh, my daughter will love that. 
You guys, I literally just drove away with the box on my car from Burlington because employees were coming out to throw out more trash and I couldn't fit this in my car so I put it on my hood and I drove down the back of the uh, parking lot. All right, so let's go through it. We have some kind of jacket. It's like a leather jacket. I don't know if anything's wrong with it. It doesn't look bad. We have undies not cut up, some shoes. Actually, things don't look too bad. Uh, I might try to shove it in my car and we'll go through it when I get home. Hey guys, so I brought this Burlington box home because it looked like there might be some salvageable stuff in here. This is not the usual Burlington I go to. This is a different one and they normally slash at this one. But when I was looking at stuff, not everything looked completely destroyed. So we have some champion boy briefs. I don't see any slashes. So those could be donated. Some kind of, what is it? What's the brand? American breed, extra large, um, definitely pleather. Uh, let's see, price 129. Definitely feels like pleather. I don't see anything wrong with it. Let's see the back. Watch out. They didn't slice it, wow. Makes me think somebody was coming back for this maybe. So this is nice. Okay, let's see what else we got. Maybe they didn't destroy everything. This is a Nike handkerchief, I think, or a bandana, I'm not sure. Some Fila socks. They're pretty high, but good for sports or cold. What is this? All right, so these are fleece lined leggings. So there might be two of them. This is what they look like. Cool. I think I'm gonna be able to wear these. I don't see any slices. Interesting. More socks, tons of Fila socks. I wonder what they were priced at. It's like they took off the price tags. That's weird. I guess just so you can't return them, but you should never return guys. That's why Employees and corporate don't like dumpster divers because they're under the impression that what we dive for, we go and return for money or store credit. I would never do that. I'm just grateful to get any useful working thing from the dumpster. So I'm happy with the things I find. Please don't ever return something that you didn't pay for that is stealing and that is wrong. Uh, so here's more socks, gaming socks. I'm actually kind of scared to touch these because I don't see a tag. Some Calvin Klein Christmas panties. Let's let's just hope that they weren't used. Headphones, gloves, Timberland gloves. This is really weird. I feel like somebody was coming back for this because this this place destroys. These were thirty dollars originally. Wow. I have a shirt, Aeropostale t-shirt. I don't know if that's legit, but it says Aeropostale, nothing's wrong with it. More champion undies, more undies, boy undies. Michael Kors boxers, you guys. Wow, this is strange. But I'm thankful, you know, some Nike, what is this? What is this? I'm not athletic at all. So wait, is this a hat? Oh God, I have no idea what this is. Is this something that goes up over your head? Is this, what is this? Uh, these Tommy Hilfiger sandals are broken, but it probably wasn't intentionally. Is this what this was? It's a dry fit bandana. It looks nothing like a bandana. <laughs> you have another shirt. There's a little bit of hot Cheetos it looks like on there. This is cute. Uh, like what is it up with all the poppets? Kind of cell phone case. Too small for my phone, but my daughter will definitely play with it. Some sandals, uh, some tank tops by Levi's. More boy boxers, like wow. Um, what is this? A Puma black t-shirt. Socks, this is pretty, it's just broken. 
yeah, it's broken. A BB box, but you could still use this. That is like really gaudy. The little kid's belt. Um, one of these cups, it's broken, but you can still use the actual cup. We have that, broken glasses. Um, AirPod case, keychain situation. What is this? I have no idea. More Calvin Klein undies. I think these are curtains. Cute. Pink and white curtains. Wow. Well, I don't, the camera's not really picking it up, um, but it is like a really light pink color. More underwear. Oh my goodness. Are these boxers? I'm not sure. No, I think they're women's. Hipsters can donate all those. Oh, that's so cute. Christmas Mickey cupcakes with little toppers. I'm going to hold on to that. Uh, some kid watches. That's cute. It's like you can change it. Oh, that's that. Um, they have those Barbies at Target. More underwear. Sahari. Scrunchy. Broken glasses. Oh, I like these. These little scent uh, things that you can put in your your dresser this is jasmine so that wasn't a bad score at all i really thought things were going to be destroyed but they weren't pretty cool you guys you won't believe what i freaking found i'm at burlington and i just found this i think it's an apple watch i'm not really sure i have to like look into it yeah that's a freaking apple watch it's dead i think um, but yeah, it was just sitting in here and this, oh, it's turning on. It was in this bag right here. I saw something white like this and I pulled it out. Sweet. I don't know how these work. I've never been into these things, but I just found a watch. Excuse my language. So guys, yes, it's definitely a Apple watch. I have no idea. I tried to Google it. Um, there's so many different ones. I don't think it's the newest one, um, but yeah, it's completely dead now. I thought maybe it charged with an iPhone charger because that's what I have, but no, it doesn't. You need a separate uh, like circle type charger. That's what I saw on Google. So I don't know, I'm probably gonna have to like buy a cord just to see if it charges now because it's completely dead before a little apple did show up but nothing does anymore. But yeah, guys, this is an Apple Watch I found at Burlington. They definitely don't sell those, so it was either an employee or a customer lost or dropped their iPhone watch and they had to throw it away. It's crazy that the employees didn't take it, but maybe they can't. So yeah, an Apple Watch. Hey guys, I'm at a TJ Maxx. There's a nice little chair in here. $39.99, $40. I'm going to see if I can fit this in my car. I don't have my truck today. And I also found this set of three picture frames. I'm sure just one of them's broke, but still pretty. I'm going to take it. 